Top ranked Arizona men's basketball tipped off against number three Purdue, the biggest game of the year so far for Arizona men's basketball. And that's saying a lot considering the Wildcats have already beaten three ranked opponents. This was as fast paced of a start as you can get. Umar Balo pokes it away. Here comes Keyshaw Johnson over to Caleb Love who slams it home. What a play. Then Johnson from the corner, his three is nothing but net. A back and forth game early in Indy. Now one of the biggest keys for Arizona in this game, limit seven foot four center Zach Eady. Well, he made it look easy there against seven footer Mo Krivas. Game tied at 26. But the first half really belonged to Purdue's guards. Here's Fletcher Lawyer, automatic from three. He made four of them in the first half. Boilermakers up 11 at the break. And Arizona just couldn't guard those guards. Second half, this time it's Braden Smith. Pull up three in transition. Smith and Lawyer combined for a whopping 53 points today. But don't count those cats out quite yet. They switched into a 2-3 zone and started getting some stops. Here's a turnover and it is showtime. Johnson with a double clutch windmill. 10 point game. Then another turnover, Love bounce pass to Balo as he's there for the two-hand jam. Wildcats cut a 17-point deficit down to four. A large reason for that, Caleb Love. He had a team-high 29 points today, plus six rebounds, three assists, and two steals. But the Cats couldn't complete the comeback. Number three, Purdue knocks off top-ranked Arizona 92-84. It's the Boilermakers' first time beating a number one team since 2000. Ironically, that also came against Arizona. For the most part, you know, they, they had their way with us a little bit, but I think our character of our program is strong, and I think our guys dug in and fought back, and I was really proud they gave us the chance. I, th I think that's, this, this is going to go a long ways to really helping our program. So Arizona drops to 8-1 and one on the season. The Cats need to have a short memory, though. Up next, Alabama and the Jerry Colangelo's Hall of Fame Series, December 20th at the Footprint Center.